The 2023 Toyota Crown is an exciting new revitalized brand and model family from Toyota and it's definitely going to be an important one moving forward. Today we're going to be talking about one of the four main variants of the Toyota Crown on that same platform that are going to be coming in the next couple of years in the footsteps of the first flagship model which is on the same platform but more of a raised sedan coupe styling and in between that we're actually going to be getting a sort of compact suv as well in addition to this estate family size larger suv which we're going to be talking about today and in terms of the styling what we can see uh, what I'm getting at and what I'm gathering is it looks a little bit like the Toyota Highlander a little bit smaller obviously given the fact that it is on the Toyota crown uh, platform but at the same time is still larger significantly larger not only is it going to be uh, larger than the other suv that we see that's going to be on this platform but there seems to be a possibility and a potential option to have three rows even with this crown uh, suv model which is quite exciting you have a good amount of space either for a family if you're going on a long trip and you need trunk space or if you need an extra seat or two uh, Toyota Crown is going to be changing the game for that. We don't have much info on the interior, but as I said, it's going to be similar finishes to what we see uh, on the 2023 Crown. That's the flagship model. Uh, and with that, we did see some updated infotainments, uh, more comprehensive uh, infotainment technology, easier to add users, larger screens, uh, just quicker overall, solid cameras. So I expect these things to be options as well on the Toyota Crown uh, SUVs here. And additionally, on that note, there is also different tr trims probably coming, which will determine what type of leather or fabric or material your interior is and speaking of the powertrains we don't have it confirmed yet but the two powertrains that have been announced for the 2023 flagship crown both hybrids uh where an electric motor actually powers the rear axle again on the infotainment this is something that you can actually see this new technology and this new platform which takes the best of both worlds a little bit of improved battery technology as well as uh, their existing powertrains obviously trimmed down to be much more efficient so with that being said the standard powertrain is a 2.5 liter inline four as the internal combustion component while you can also get a 2.4 liter inline four uh, making 340 horsepower and we're expecting somewhere between 350 and 400 horsepower and pound feet of torque uh, for this SUV model, hopefully coming 2024, latest 2025 by our estimations.